Here we go, we're halfway up Cat Bells. Well, we're not halfway up. The winds have come on the other side of the mountain because the winds, even down in Keswick, were like 30, 40 mile an hour. They are ridiculous. Every now and then, the wind just picks up and takes hold of the tent. So I've come on the other side and uh, there's Keswick in the background. Okay, I've got up to the first plateau that you get to when you come up to Cat Bells. If you go over to, well, anywhere around the ridge or the summit, the winds are going to be 60 plus miles an hour. Every now and then the wind just comes around and whips hold of the tent. Really, really strong wind. Um, it's 20, 22nd of December. It's not cold at all. I, I, I was going to pack some like warmer stuff, but there's no need. It's not, not cold. But the wind is unbelievable once you get, you know, round the other side of the hill. So it's given out torrential rain all night. So we'll just see how we get on with this. I'm, I'm really interested to find out how this tent's going to cope with, uh, with relentless rain. Gonna have tonight um, one of these dehydrated meals, chicken curry, which is delicious. And just as a treat, because it's Christmas, I'm gonna stick a look what we found in as well. Anything tastes nice on the hill, doesn't it? Occasionally, there'll be a gust of wind that I don't know what it gets up to, 60 mile an hour at least. It just comes in like a, a tornado and then it disappears. Never lasts more than five seconds. It's been raining continuously from half past six. It's about what the heck time is it now? I ain't got a clue. What time is uh, twenty past four. Twenty past four. Um, uh, it's weird. What happens is the wind either comes from the back here or it comes from this side, if it comes from the side, flip me, it gets really windy. I've just checked all around the tent, got soaked, and it had only pulled one peg out. The pegs really that come with this are, are, are rubbish. I should have paid more attention. Here we go. changing direction. It was hitting the tent from the back, now it's hitting it this way on. Oh. It's funny you know last night when I was pitching this tent I was thinking come on you coward go a bit further up the, the, the uh, fell. But it's just common sense was saying, don't go any further up, stay where you are. And I'm so glad I did now, because um, I think up there it would have utterly wrecked the tent. I'm sure of it. Been a wild, wild night. Six o'clock in the morning now. It's been ra it rained from, uh, 
half past six at night till about probably half past five this morning. Um, it's not so good. Here's a scarf one. I took a battering last night. A real battering. <laughs> it was a great night. Really enjoyed it. It's my first proper night out in uh, really bad wind. Doesn't look like anything now, but the gusts were getting up to 60, 70 mile an hour last night. And this little tent here did fantastic. Really pleased. As you can see, I didn't come too far up. Cat bells. I got up to here, and the winds were that bad that. I decided this was enough. So there's the top. I just come this side because over the other side there it's just insane. 